Cleanup is now underway one day after two tornadoes touched down in Charlotte County. In a matter of moments, dozens of homes were badly damaged in the storm's wake. For many residents, this is a case of deja vu. Some of those same neighborhoods were struck by Hurricane Charlie back in 2004. John Rogers joining us now live in Charlotte County with the update this evening. And it's going to take a while for all of this cleanup to be completed, as it did in years past. It certainly will, Keith, because uh, just take a look at where I am right now. I want to show you a good idea of the damage here. This is the home of Mr. and Mrs. Privat here in Port Charlotte. I'm standing in what used to be their pool cage. It's been crushed like a soda can. I'm trying to be very ginger as I walk around here. There's insulation and nails everywhere. Plants were plucked off the ground. Trees were stripped. Large portions of the roof are missing. This is just an idea of what a number of residents are dealing with all throughout this area because it seems like this storm sort of skipped and affected many people across a wide area. A big, big mess. Al Santoro feels helpless. His backyard was gutted after Wednesday's tornadoes. And for him, this all came as quite a shock. Al, what were you thinking when you drove back and saw this? I said, what the hell's going on here? I, I, I didn't realize what was going on. Charlotte County emergency officials say the two tornadoes destroyed 11 homes and damaged 25 others. All across the area, trees are uprooted, garages are bent out of shape, and roofs were torn apart. Today, power crews and contractors were out in force trying to bring this place back to normal. This area was tested back in 2004 when Hurricane Charlie hit. These residents rebuilt back then, and they're determined to rebuild now. Although, that doesn't make this present reality any easier. This is what it is. This is what it is. Yeah, certainly a lot of work left to do. Some contractors just left this house about half an hour ago, but uh, they certainly got their work cut out for them because there are a lot of houses similar to the, this one. Thankfully, there are no reported injuries. And also, we're told Florida Governor Rick Scott is going to be here in this neighborhood sometime within the next hour or so uh, to check out the place and to speak with residents and speak with the media as well. So as soon as we get that, we'll be sure to bring it to you. Back to you. This is also one of those times where people need to be extra careful. A lot of people come in, try to scam people. See a lot of mess like this. They want to overcharge, overbill, uh, gouge. Uh, Got to be extra careful. I'm sure the governor will talk about that as well. John Rogers live in Charlotte County tonight. Thanks, John.